let's learn how to play background noises with iOS 15. Welcome everybody to Apple Insider. It is Andrew here, and I'm gonna show you how you can play background noise, dark noise, white noise, uh, rainfall, all of that in the background as part of iOS 15 and iPadOS 15. I am gonna demo this here on my iPad Pro, but yeah, it works just as well on your iPhone. You just follow the exact same steps. Everything's the same, just on a different device. And this will work both using the speakers of your device. So if you're working in your own space and you wanna use the speakers, or if you are in an office environment or a shared space and you wanna use headphones, that's just as good too. Put in your AirPods Pro or any other third-party headphones uh, and you can listen to them through the headphones. But uh, in this case, we're gonna show you on the speakers, give you some examples of what the sound sounds like and let's go ahead and dive into this thing. To use background noises on your iPhone or iPad with iOS 15 or iPadOS 15, the first thing you need to do is open the Settings app. Within Settings, we're gonna go down and tap on Accessibility. Inside of Accessibility, we're gonna scroll down again until we see Audio and Visual. Once we tap into that, we have an option for background sounds. And of course, right now it is off. And when we go into that, you can turn background sound on or off right there at the top. So let's go ahead and turn it on real quick. Some nice rainfall going on. Um, but yeah, so that is how you turn background sounds on and off here from the settings app. But we have a lot of different options. So if I tap on sound, you can see the six different options for background noise. So there is balanced noise, let's give it a listen. Here's bright noise. Here's dark noise. We've got ocean. We have rain. And we have stream. Now the first time that you download or go to play any of these, it will need you to download the audio first. So it might just take a second before it starts playing as it downloads the required audio files. A few other options to go with this. You can see we have the volume here. You can turn that up anywhere from zero to 100 to choose the level of volume for that background sound. You can also choose whether or not to use this when media is playing. That could be a video or audio and you can turn that on or off. So do you like to have a little bit of background noise while you're listening to a podcast or listening to music, or do you want it to stop when that media is playing? You can choose that here, and there's even an option to play a sample. So a sample track will play with the background noise going on at the same time. Finally, you have the option to stop sounds when locked. So maybe while you're using your device, background sounds are on, but when you are done, you lock your device, you lock your iPhone or your iPad, those background sounds can stop. So it's entirely up to you which you prefer. Now you don't want to have to go into, you know, settings here every time that you want to start or stop your background noise. You could want to do it just, you know, when you're working or certain times. Fortunately, there's a much easier way to toggle it on and off. And I'm going to tell you all about it. But first, I have to thank our sponsor for this video, Nebbia. Seriously, what a great video for Nebbia to sponsor. As we talk about background sounds like running water, Nebbia creates some of the most amazing shower heads that I've ever used. When I bought our new house, I was dying to start, you know, renovating all the different stuff around. And one of the first things that I did that both me and my wife loved was updating our bathroom, including putting in a new Nebbia by Moen shower head. This thing is incredible. Uh, I have been following Nebbia for years, including back when it was, you know, invested in by Tim Cook, but I've enjoyed it for its, you know, environmentally friendly options, being able to save water and save money while you were showering to the same amount. It also just has a great look to it, and I love the additional wand that can work at the same time as your shower head. So you can use the shower and the wand at the same time, and it creates this surreal spa-like experience in your own shower. We have used this for a long time now. It was so easy to set up and install. It looks amazing. It was one of the best upgrades we made to our house when we got it, but of course it'll work, you know, pretty much for anyone. It's so easy to use. If you guys want to grab one for yourself, there is a 15% off code, head to nebbia.com slash AI. And if you use promo code AI, you can get 15% off 
any of your Nebbia products, any Nebbia purchase. And they really, really do this, guys. So if you want to take advantage of this, I recommend you do it now before this offer goes away. Again, nebbia.com slash AI and use promo code AI. Otherwise, let's go back, checking out those background sounds and how we can more easily toggle them on and off. The other way that you can toggle background sounds on or off is via control center. Just like you would toggle off do not disturb, you can do the same thing with background sounds. But first you need to make sure you have it added to control center. So if we jump back into our settings app, we're gonna go down to control center, and then we're gonna look for hearing, the little blue ear icon. You wanna make sure that is included controls. It is in the list included controls. So if you don't see it, just go down to more controls and hit the little plus button to add it to your list of included controls. You can change its layout. Do you wanna move it up or down the list? We'll just leave it there at the bottom in this case. And now, anytime I go into control center, I have that little ear icon. If I tap on that, there's live listen using my AirPods, but there's also background sounds. I can just tap it to turn it on or turn it off. It is that easy to do. So just like you would toggle on Wi-Fi, you can toggle on background sound whenever it is convenient to help you focus, de-stress, whatever the case. I am loving background sounds with iOS 15 and iPadOS 15. This is just one of many, many new features coming down with these updates that are going to be released this September. Let me know what you guys think. You can let me know on Twitter at Andrew underscore OSU and stay tuned. You guys know I love you. I'll see you in the next video.